Okay, so this is the STE working quite nice with its hard disk. It's all plugged in there. Uh, it's going through the frame converter. So what I'm going to do is to switch this off, like so. Uh, you, uh, and then I'm going to take the power lead off here. And I'm going to plug it into this. Be careful, I don't touch the wrong things. This uh, power supply here. I'm going to put it into this old Atari STFM. Like that, isn't it? And find out if this keyboard combination works with it. Uh, so then I've got to basically plug my mod into it. Well, I don't have to because I've got a keyboard. I just need to plug the monitor in first of all. So where would the keyboard normally go? I don't need a disk drive, it would just take ages to start up. There's the wire. Oh yeah, it would normally go like that, wouldn't it? Yep. So the keyboard is there, isn't it? That's right. And there's a little dot there, so there's the hole. It has to go that way. Sorry. Like so. Hang on. Well, it has to go like that. Oops. Yeah. Danger, Will Robinson. Uh, that's for the disk drive power. So what I'll do is I'll just rest that on top of there like that. That should be okay. If I begin to drop this, whatever I do, don't grab that power supply. So let me just power it up. And we seem to have it up and running. Uh, now, it's not very stable at the minute. Not surprising, because it's messing around. And it's an STFM rather than an STE, so it might need a bit more work. Uh, what was it? The alt key was. Hang on, give me a second. I might want to do this with two hands. Let me just try something. Yeah, I can't really do this because I've got to hold down the alt key uh, and move the mouse. There, you see? Yeah. It's doing something. Oops, sorry, you can't see it. Uh, hold up. Try it one time last time. There, uh, go up to the top, go to the left, yeah, down, and then push the sh alt and the insert, there we go. Oh, that's not very helpful, is it? Okay, that's doing something. I have the potential to get this STFM working. Yeah, it's just crashed, I think, because I think I did something wrong there. But anyway, this is pretty cool. Thank you to the sender from eBay for the keyboard. It looks different to the other one. It's a kind of bit more faded but in some respects yeah look it's a different color that's like a don't ask me that's a sort of gray color isn't it this is a sort of beige color it doesn't matter i don't care if it's to do with coloring or something the point is it seems to be working so now i can try and get on with the ram upgrade i printed out thank you for watching